Hi students, in this session I would like to share my personal opinion about ESC, IRMS, GATE and public sectors are not recruiting through GATE. Means in all this I would like to give my personal opinion. Basically I will add my personal experiences also and many other initiatives are creating some kind of mess or uh, some kind of insecurity they are proliferating among the students. It's my personal opinion and I will share uh, previous experiences also about this. One thing here is, for example, gate, okay, from public, uh, maybe some public sectors, maybe Vizag steel plant, okay, they stop recruiting or they postpone the decision of uh, whether to recruit through gate or not, okay, don't get tense, don't get tense because ultimately they need engineers, no, okay, so ultimately Vizag steel plant or NTPC or whatever it may be, they need engineers, for example, let me tell you about ESC or IRMS, okay, ESC is not going to be dissolved, Okay, it is going to be modified. One thing I will tell you because I cleared gate and many things in a single year because I never studied like we are preparing for gate or we are preparing for ESC. Let us learn electrical engineering as a whole. Okay, from subject point of view, let me give you one small example. For example, we have a transformer. In this transformer, we have tap changer. Okay, unload tap changer. So that unload tap changer can be automatic or can be manual. Okay. So normally in India we are using manual tap changer only because compared to automatic unload tap changer, engineer's salary is less. Yes. Okay. Because though in my opinion, though some public sectors or some privatization of something may happen, but we are cheapest people here. Okay. So our labor is going to be cheap. Like engineers also, they cannot bring engineers from UK or maybe USA and all because they charge more so even if it is getting privatized for example okay trust electrical engineering they need engineers they have to recruit us only they have to recruit us only and let me tell you about this present actually i'm also feeling very bad very bad about the present decision of uh, withdrawing railways withdrawing from ese but anyway i'll tell you one thing <coughs> I think two years back, till two years back, our ESC, our uh, date of birth, date of birth they used to consider from January 1st for ESC, same UPSC and for civil services they used to consider from August 1st. Okay, I have my personal experience also, I will tell you. But anyway, I think two years back they reverted or they changed from January 1st to August 1st. Because of that, our student, one of my students, called as Shivareddy. Shivareddy, he completed his master's, he, was, uh, he started working as a lecturer in one of the college in Pune. Okay? And after that, he came to know about this decision. About this decision, he lost one attempt because that attempt is going to be his last attempt because he was about to complete 30. Okay? Even for me, my experience means I was born on uh, January 9th, 1980. Okay, but my parents, because my, means I came from very much uneducated family and kind of poor family and kind of village background. Okay, so my parents didn't know what to write on the, what do you say, date of birth. So my faculty at that time, my teachers has written 17, 18, 1779. Okay, so I never thought about that such a great way. But later, once I entered into civil services, Okay, so see here August 1st they will consider normally so as a date of birth so prior to that like you know 12 days or 13 days prior my date of birth happened so I lost my last attempt okay so I didn't give my last attempt because previously prior to entering into civil services I thought that okay I'm going to get these many attempts let us start preparation. But all of a sudden, just within 17, 8, uh, sorry, 18, 7, 79, they have written and my official thing, okay? And within 12 days gap, I lost one attempt. Did I die? Okay? No, no, don't get scared. And one more thing is even this year also, this year also means who are getting affected by this decision, who, who's are going to be the last attempt for this, okay? So maybe whoever are uh, crossing 30, their number will be very less and their life also will not be stopped here okay you worked hard really okay so actually people are uh, creating such a mess saying like you please send mails you please send this you please send that okay don't get insecurity don't get insecurity we are not going to die we are going to be entrepreneurs we are leaders okay so for others also for example Vizag steel plant maybe they postpone the decision whether to take it from a gate or not but Vizag steel plant, they need, uh, what do you say, engineers, no? 
okay so they need engineer they may conduct separate exam maybe ntpc may conduct separate exam or bhl may conduct separate exam bark is anyway conducting separate exam from my time onwards okay so guys may take uh, what do you say our uh, public sector view and it can take directly from gate because directly from gate there are some issues you know people are taking directly iit admissions first and after that some delay is happening after some delay what's happening here they are getting the public sectors and they are moving out of out to, to public sectors leaving iit seats so they have some frictions they have some frictions so one thing i will tell you all public sectors may withdraw okay forget about it for example all public sectors has withdrawn from gate okay so let it be we are not preparing for gate or we are not preparing for ese we are preparing electrical engineering as a whole once you learn complete electrical engineering complete electrical engineering it may be gate or it may be ese or it may be anything okay and one more thing is for ese means next year pattern we don't know okay as of now i too don't know the next year pattern nobody know okay so for irms next year whenever they get any pattern we are abide it we have to okay so we are going to for example this year fees many guys has paid uh, esc fees and all for them as per the irms modified thing we are going to provide okay so whoever are there at 24 years 27 years 28 years need not be bothered need not be bothered whoever are going to lose that 30 means this peer attempt only for whom this attempt is going to be the last attempt for them only effect will be there okay for them also i'm telling you dear you are crossing about to cross 30 years means that you are grown you know how to lead life okay so for example means actually i'm also feeling very sorry really sorry for them it's really bad decision but that bad decision is affecting only some people don't try, try to propagate the things to complete engineering saying like some government is doing that some government is doing this maybe there are background analysis will be there and the one thing i will tell you means nrc is there ca is there how much opposition we are getting okay so at least government how much opposition they are getting but still but still they are continuing with it now means our engineers are small portion out of total population and in that engineers esc aspirants are very less in that whoever are about to cross 30 is going to be much less okay i last one item dear i know the pain i know the pain i expected that uh, means mine i will not cross 30 by assuming my original date of birth as jan 9th but i lost one attempt at the end i came to know we lost one attempt that's okay i let the life i let the life and somehow compared to civil services or compared to ias whatever the life i'm leading now may not be financially but maybe because of all of your what do you say likes love and all i'm really leading a happy life okay so don't bother much don't think much learn electrical engineering the uh, attempt gate attempt uh, any public sector exam attempt any private jobs for example i'll tell you what is the difference between ntpc and tata power okay so can i say tata power is private job i will lease one uh, ntpc is such a great one no okay so in private sector also much opportunities are there for example i never said that means don't go to corporate no i, I myself worked in vlsi okay complete corporate field so get ready for anything okay at last let me tell you one thing our uh, my role model bruce lee bruce lee say one thing okay one should be like a water okay it should flow it should flow okay with the time let us flow and if you pour water into a cup it will become a cup if you pour water into a bottle it will become a bottle if you pour water into a teacup it will become a teapot it will become a teapot i love it a lot means be like a water if you pour water into gate exam be gate exam if you pour water into for example any public sector uh, separate exam attempt it everybody has to give electrical engineering only maybe some portions may be extra for example maybe if at all if ntpc conduct separate exam for example if at all if they conduct separate exam maybe they may give general studies anyway electrical engineering is the main portion general studies i'll be there i'll be there okay so let us combine electrical engineering let us see all the exams in a proper way don't uh, what do you say don't uh, look low level about the public sectors and all okay let us rock dear very all the best. It's my personal opinion. Thank you all.